miles from where we started I should have never walked away And parts of me believe that I should have seen it coming I wish we had another day Looking back I understand All the things that didn't go the way I planned All these thoughts keep me awake It's this feeling that I can't shake But we kept running and running Though we were out of breath Wish I could have known that we're broken By the weight that's on my chest
please? Oh, it's been a hot second. I, I want you to meet Freya, but she's curled up with Enzo at my feet right now, so I'm not wanting to bug them. Um, as soon as they get up, though, I will make sure that <laughs> I get her. She's sleeping. She's such a good girl. Like, Enzo's nuts, but Enzo's always nuts. But he's sleeping down there, too, so. So this is a rare moment of peace in the house right now. But I've missed you guys. I'm... I should be back, back now. Vacation's over. Um... Well, it's not over, over. I still have this weekend, but I've got more things I'm doing this weekend. So, I'm here today for a couple hours, and then <clears throat> I'll be back Monday. Monday and maybe Tuesday. And I also started... Oh, excuse me. I forgot where I was going with that. I was going somewhere with that. But, hi Zelda. Oh, I've missed you. How have you been, bud? Excuse me. It's already been a morning. I got a new TV. All my old game systems are hooked up to it. <laughs> so it's been fun. Right now I just have the, the GameCube and the PS2 hooked up. Actually, so I hooked up my PlayStation and realized that I must have left all Daddy of my controllers at Ben's house. Uh, I have to remember how to play again. Okay, for a second I was like, oh my god, did I unmute myself? <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time. Seeing the body electric. I really don't remember where we were with all this. Miss Oliphant says she sent Gemma to ask the workers about their art projects, but I have a sneaking suspicion something's gone wrong there. Alright. And we can walk around at night. I... Oh, I think it was his flashlight. Oop, I'm not on Joy. Oh, I'm not on Joy. Will she get me? I think she will. Where the fuck am I? Oh, yeah, that new town. Okay, um... I think I can go around this way. You've been great? Nope, there we go. What makes it great? <clears throat> Hi guys, friends, pals. Hey, there's some. She's. That's fine, but Freya's up now. So Freya, come here. Come here, baby girl. Oh, hey. Hey, so. Yes, I'm just Hold on. Oh, she's so cute. This, oh, look, I threw the mic out of the way. This is Freya. And Enzo. And Enzo. She's a snuggler. You can hold her. Because she's a snuggler. She likes the snuggles. She loves you too. She just wants to play with the baby. <laughs> oh, look at her little tail wag. Oh my god. <laughs> alright, 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 alright. <laughs> Hi, Tweak. I'm stuck in my own chair. Oh, you're so cute. You're so cute. You were a little cutie. Yeah, she cuddles like, I love like a little it. baby. I love it. She's just so cool with it. Yeah. And now, She's just fine with hanging out in my arms. Hi. Look at her little tail wag. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she chills her like a baby. Enzo. Enzo's jealous. Yeah, he is. Look at him, Nikki. They got nuts, too. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. Here. Yeah, you want to go see him? That's right. little lady Luna Freya. 
Oh, okay. Hey, be nice. Yeah. She's like, I'm gonna go back right now. Yeah, she. Well, she's probably. Oh, she's slipped off. Oh, oh. Anzo, stop the barking. Oh. Anywho, hi, Tweet. <laughs> hi, you men. <laughs> There's so many constables. Like, there's no way you could go through this at night without that perk. Uh, let's go all the way over there. Silly me. Medium mess. I'd love to know why that particular bin smells of cheese. It's constant. What time is it? It's 11. Okay, so about noon, I'm gonna have to let him out again. She will not stop eating. Like, Enzo, I've always left food in his bowl. Um, he'll graze whenever, and he doesn't eat that much. But her, if I leave food, if it's Enzo's food, her puppy food, it doesn't matter. Like, she will eat it. So. I have to watch what I leave out now. It's a good time. She's a little fatty. <laughs> you think so? I'm afraid of her being fat, like overweight. Her vet appointments in two weeks. Well, her next vet appointments in two weeks. I'm afraid of them being like, what are you feeding her? Like, she is too fat. But everybody's always told me I was too little, so I guess... I can't do nothing right! <laughs> you take your time. Ah, okay, 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 okay! Don't yell at me. Um... Can I go past them? I just don't know if it's a banned area. Police. Yes, yes it is. Don't mind me, I'm just trying to find my joy. Uh, I have to go back around to the left. Alright, alright, alright. Don't mind me. Did they yell at me? I don't know if I can run or not. Did I get that perk? Oh, <laughs> uh, when I got home yesterday, yesterday, um, Enzo went nuts, and I just got the video sent to me. I thought there was pills right here. I'm not seeing them. Am I losing my mind? There's a joy booth right here. What's that sound? What's going on here? Oh. Okay. So is there no joy right here? Joy oh, it's in this yard? Oh, hey, cool. Well, fuck. I guess we can just run by. Did I get that perk or are they just ignoring me? No longer annoy people. Okay, so I can sprint all the way through here now. Sounds good. You will take your joy immediately. Whoa! Oh, I got spooked. Hey, I almost fucking turned around. <laughs> this is a municipal work site, and you're not a municipal worker, are you? Huh? 
so clear off. Grumpy ass. Mm, do I have the boiler suit on me? I do. I told you I would send them to you now. Central sent me to help out. Oh, and I suppose you learned all about municipal infrastructure back at Central. I like to think I can figure a few things out. Oh, you can figure things out. Who needs what a 20 dick. years of experience when the new lads can just suss it out with their eyes? Hey, let's all learn from the new lad! Well, this seems fairly obvious. Don't you just turn that? Turn the valve. And so. Don't! Never heard it do that before. Oh dear. I, uh, there's huh? a tool I need. I'll, I'll just oh, go get it. Ass, what so. did he do to it? Has anybody got a pipe wrench? Run, run. Oh. Ow. I should really have paid more attention when Dad was banging on the plumbing. I hope they're not dead. No, they're just unconscious. Hold on, they're getting too rough. You know I hear you, right? Right? Where's your dog pic, CJ? Oh, she's such a good girl, though. Ah, I'm all wrapped up in my cord. I'm gonna put you behind me, okay? You lay down there. You stop. Look at her. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I'm done. I'm done. You're just. I don't know. You're so precious. You're so precious. And so you are too. I still love you, puppy. Lots and lots. But you gotta leave her alone. When she starts making noises like that. Ugh. You just can't leave her alone. Hey! Back up! Come on! Thank you. Yeah. This morning. Uh, this morning. What was I gonna say? Oh, they were all curled up together. It was. It was the best. On the other hand, it looks like I can get down now. Yeah. 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 <coughs> She's falling asleep now. <coughs> That's not me coughing, is it? Oh, I have a gas mask. Can I wear that? Well, I already had one. But I mean, is that gonna get me through the- That is it! That wouldn't get me through the fire. That was me coughing. We can't run with all this stuff. You better throw something away before something starts chasing you. Damn it, Arthur. Oops. I'll need to find a way to turn the juice back on. And yet another note about bad joy. Gemma was really onto something, wasn't she? Alright, let's read that note. I need to uh, drop something real quick. Boop. Okay, great. No, 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 no. Blackberry. Okay. 
Dr. Verlock, my men seem to have received a weak batch of joy. That is, it makes them half as happy. Unfortunately, it makes them just as foggy. As a result, they have been doubling up on joy, and this is making them rather too foggy to work. Could you please send a regular strength ration of joy as soon as possible? Is Blackberry a possibility? Not good, is it? Yeah, I was assuming the flavor. Blackberry sounds better than coconut. Uh, Chief Engineer. Okay, dear Mr. Watt, one of my workers has made an artwork out of live electrical wires. Although the boys are quite fond of it, it is creating a hazard. The tenor of our Tunnel Rats Quartet was electrocuted this morning. We are not able to get past the sculpture to reach the rest of the facility safely. Could you kindly shut off the sector's power grid just long enough for me to remove the artwork? Is that what did all this? A second re-sublimation? Oh my god, of the Theo modeling crystals might enhance the endochronic properties. If we were truly able to enable the endochronic properties. <laughs> Reading is hard. <laughs> we could use the same crystals indefinitely. But yeah, you got me. No, we don't have anything. Alright. All right, focus, focus, focus. I hope I don't have anything here. Huh? This is a okay. Danger! Watch out. Nobody got nothing for me. Hey, to Alfred from Trisha, we are all dismayed to learn that your glee learn of your glee club's misfortune. I'm enclosing two copies of form A221, unexpected staff holiday, which must be completed in triplicate, as well as one copy of of form Fin753, departmental budget adjustment report. They should be filled in and returned in three days. What is she talking about? Do I want to know? Tea? There's just tea chilling here. Yeah, interesting flavor. Uh oh, she jumped down. I didn't even look to. Alright. And so. Just because she's down there doesn't mean you need a fighter. <laughs> they might get loud. I'm apologizing in advance. Requires power. Okay, so it's probably back down in here, huh? He's just sitting there barking at her. Well, that's not where I'm going. Stop it. something big. I am on fire. That's cool. October <laughs> fire safety month. Hey! Get back. Shoot. Shoot fly. Don't bother me. 
And yeah, that's victory me. Women and so I swear to god. This is this is where I've been. Dealing with these guys. Okay, well this is obviously just a maintenance. So and we can't do anything down the right. Sell that, correct? This doesn't actually go anywhere. Okay, guess not. Okay. So whatever we need is this way. Ninety nine point twenty five. That really help? This is going to be, you're right, this is going to be it. I mean, I saw that it turned off. The stuff, sorry, it turned off the stuff throughout here, but I don't really know what that did. Hey, tweak! The buttons. The buttons. The buttons. Fucking with me, boy. Could you seven months? You've been with me so much longer than that, though. Hey! Hey! Alright, we got power. How do I cross that platform without getting electrocuted? Now make Why sure there isn't a short there? circuit to. <laughs> fucking apprentices. They never fucking listen. All oh, those buttons. Well, you know what? You were right, I though, because it led me to the buttons, so it worked out. Okay, alright. Is that the artwork they were talking about? All employees from the supervisor. It has come to my attention that certain employees are using live wires as Victory Day sparklers. Let me remind you that Victory Day is now for several more months, besides which the sparklers are a safety hazard. On the subject of safety hazards, whose turn is it to empty the rain buckets? I found four of them overflowing on Tuesday. Kindly do not let this happen again. So we got a bunch of water buckets overflowing and they're using sparklers or live wires and sparklers seems legit To whom it may concern, we've had a bit of an accident. Henrietta made muffins for the bake sale, but mistakenly used the almond gas for flavoring. She's now gone on holiday and I've given my staff leave until further notice. Meanwhile, do not eat the muffins or enter sector three without a gas mask. She accidentally Maybe poisoned the no muffins. muffins. You don't think Even on joy, people aren't that stupid. Unless there's something wrong with the joy. That's what I, I was like, Tweak, what do you mean? Like, do they just let the water everywhere? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's probably why. God damn it. Got all sorts of dig spots in this place. I can't flip any of those. Okay. I guess 
hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Rubber duck. Um. What is the, the tickler? I just don't get it sometimes. Ooh. I don't know, it's like there's hearts on it. Like, why are there hearts? I've always wanted to drive one of those things. They sort of look like tea kettles, don't they? How have I not noticed that? Oh, let's check this way first. Ooh. What was that? Why does it sound like there's somebody around? Alright, down we go. The tickler? Sounds like a Batman villain? Is that what you just said? High-speed jub jubilators. What's up here? Yep, that seems totally safe. Oh, come on, you pack rat. You can't take all this with you. like this. I don't use the bombs at all. Did I just drink something? I just drank something. Well, let's hope it was drinkable. Oh, I got drunk. I meant to drop it. I just pressed the wrong button. Oh, well, I should be going. Oh. All right. All right. Thank you for your response to my letter about bad batches of joy. While I appreciate your offer, if I send any employee who has a problem with the recent batch of joy to Hot Hayworth for your experimental treatment, you'll have my entire bloody staff knocking on your gate. I hope you've got a plan B. Uh, the joy's going bad. That will drive the entire town crazy. I'll throw in the glass bottles next. Is this where I was? No, okay. Hey, dear Mr. Southwick, thank you for your recent memo. We are experiencing a temporary problem while we adjust the joy formula slightly to take advantage of some new materials. Meanwhile, it can't hurt if they double their dosage, can it? The more, the merrier. They're adjusting the formula. New materials. That sounds encouraging. Don't want people sound encouraging in Wellington Wells. Something terrible is usually happening. Uh, it doesn't bother me. So far, she hasn't done anything in there. Oh, you're not a bloody mule. Pick what you can carry easily. You're not a bloody mule. Don't tell me how to live my life, bud. Look at this. Why do I need a... Uh, I have a head cold, if you can't tell. It's super. It's a good time. Stop. Okay, well I found two pieces of evidence. That's not one, right? 
still missing a third piece of evidence. Maybe it's back in the other room and I just... Because I didn't search the other room at all. I happened along the right path. Okay. Missing something somewhere. What? <sighs> Extra fun. Well, I don't seem to be able to do anything to it. Can't seem to. disappears in the nothingness. And this switch doesn't do anything. Can't go through there. <laughs> what a Batman kick. Oh my sweet baby Jesus. I just wanted to check that office room again because that's where I found the two evidence. I thought maybe. Just maybe. Supposed to be quite so many red lights on this board. Oof. So, does that get me what I want down there? Well, it's becoming rather unhealthy in here. Maybe I'll be safer in the jubilator. God, suck things. Well, this is the slowest roller coaster I've ever been on. My way! My way for Captain Toad of Total! Sorry, can't stay. 
I don't think that was supposed to happen. <laughs> just, just the feeling. So there's an exit door here, I think, but I'm gonna have to turn on some power cool. switches. Gotta drop some stuff yeah, off. Yeah, really... oh, It's gonna be tediously slow going. Need to stop picking stuff up. This is my real problem. Enzo! I see you. Her paws are bigger than his paws. He doesn't like that. Is that how the puppies get around? I wonder if they ever get that stuck. Was the part. That could get awkward. I'm gonna pull up a BRB. I'm 99% sure somebody went potty. I can smell it. It's a good time. But I will be right back.
been catching feels, I've been catching flights. Maybe we can chill when I get the time. Told you I'm a call. The storm is rolling in Thunder shakes the bones beneath my skin
vultures circle and the sheep they talk I pray for a strain against the pain I break Working up on balance, we ain't got it I'm back, sorry. Um, it wasn't Freya, it was Enzo. He has a bellyache, so we went outside for a little bit. Yeah. Enzo, leave her alone. Come here. Freya. Come here. I can hear him fucking with her. But yeah, that's, oh shit, you can see him in there. I'm sorry, I'm trying. Enzo, come here. You think Don? For ya. You hear that? I mean, it'll be fine. He's just being a butthead. So, all right. Oh, there's somebody over there. Can I climb over this? Nope, looks like I'm going down. Oh shit. More bets from Peter until he pays up. Look at these guys. Look at these guys. She looks so happy though. Like she's having fun. They're just being butts. Sorry. There. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. I'd love to stay here, but I can't. Where's the door? Lube and suction. For heaven's sake, doesn't anything work around here? I think if I redirect the modeling. I tried to slow down Peter's jubilator like you asked, but the robust buggers. Turns out a jubilator only has three weaknesses. A big electric shock, bashing open the rear access panel, and extracting the activator. There might only be two come to think of it. Obviously none of these things is exactly the grid. And if 
I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Yeah, but I feel like I'm gonna need those. For what? I don't know yet. And jubilators no longer detect you. I need one more point! Damn it. That would have been so useful right now. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, uh, what don't I need? Can I drink this? I'll we'll just drink this now. Boop. Boop. Well, it didn't help entirely the way I wanted it to. Okay. So there's no power in here. Don't really need that. I think if I redirect the modeling to power the grid. I need to look at the modeling. But isn't the modeling? Do not take your gas mask off to sing. Alright. I can't, and you're right, until somebody bites a little too hard. I can't wait until she gets big enough to stand up for herself. I mean, they're playing now, and he doesn't really hurt her. He just doesn't know when to stop. And she gets annoyed. I sort of think this place is about to explode. What is? That's fine, but I want that really bad, so that's worth dropping. Are you guys done? They're not done. Listen to them. Listen to them be buttheads. You know I hear you, right? Can I sort by weight? No. Cool. I put her up there so you wouldn't mess with her. Oh boy. Or maybe I just run into him here. Alright, dear Anton, my workers seem to have received a weak batch of joy. That is, it makes them half as happy, unfortunately. Okay, we already read that one. Odd. Call elevator. Oh, is this where we were earlier? So this... Hold oh, on, an idiot. Well, that was weird, but alright. Whoa! I'd be mad at him, but I watched her just reach down and bite his paw when he wasn't messing with her. Mother trucker, why is it doing that? <laughs> oh, I keep going up. You two are annoying. Hey, don't play inside. Go. Are you done? Are you done? Your butt head. Are you done with your butt head? Yeah, what are you doing? What are you doing with butt head? She's egging, egging him on as much as he's screwing with her. Where? What? Alright, so that one only leads there. Can I crouch? Oh, I can crouch. Hard dirt. Alright. Okay, that's one. Two more, I think. Still doesn't help me with the modeling situation. Can I search him? Oh, what is? Car wash key card? 
Week. I'm trying to play, but this is why I haven't been streaming. Alright, anywho. Whoop. Okay, that worked. I, for you, can you lay down, princess? Can you lay down? She peed on me last night, so that was cool. Exactly what I wanted. <laughs> Princess. She wants to play. You guys can play, but don't play behind me. Go, go play somewhere else. Okay? Here. Well, that unplugged my headset. Alright, anywho. Focusing again, I swear. Ugh, all right. So can I go back? Is this gonna let me, um... Is it coming my way? There's the power room. How am I supposed to get across? Can I jump in there? Percy, what are you doing? I'm swimming. Oh, good Christ. Where are your clothes? Percy, where are your clothes? Somebody likes that skinny dipping, yo. Tribulators. Cool. All right, to all employees, please not. Hey! I'm ignoring this for a reason, dear iPad. I'm not a mute to anything. Um, to dispose of, okay, please know that the proper function of a jubilator is to dispose of downers who have gone on holiday in public and to diffuse airborne joy, diffuse airborne joy to citizens who may have forgotten to take their pills. A jubilator is not a mechanical steed for just the embedding. We are becoming quite shorthanded as a result of this tomfoolery since the cockpit burns up when one jubilator smashes another. They are almost invincible except for the electrical issues we are working on, but even a rock can be broken by another rock. Touche, Zelda. Touche. It has further come to my attention that certain employees attempted to sabotage jubilators to gain advantage in illicit competitions. Perpetrators will be caught and damage will be docked from their pay. Penelope. P.S. Kindly do not sound the tootlers indoors. It alarms the secretaries. The tootlers. Okay.
Maybe I just took it all on accident. Whoops. Whoa! I'm not getting past those jets without getting poached like an egg. Can I turn them off? You can't... I can't crouch under these ones? No, okay. Crouching under these ones is not the option they're looking for. Both of them. Hey! Buttheads. Oop, that is not a way to go, I guess. Whoosh. Okay. to turn on this bloody door. Didn't I turn that on? Did I miss the switch? I don't think I missed the switch there. Gosh! <laughs> Damn it! I thought maybe I missed it. If I fall, okay, that's not bad. Um, I thought maybe I missed the switch. That's definitely where that goes. Oh, this is where I need to be going. I need all three. You're right. You're right. My bad. My bad. Doesn't anything work around here? I think if I redirect the modeling to power the grid. Okay, but where do I redirect the modeling? I mean, I remember it in the beginning. How do I get all the way back there? I don't think I can go all the way back there. Can I? Oh. Well, that doesn't take me anywhere, though. Can I climb on top of you? Hmm. else in here. We are sure of that. So the car wash is done. Going behind doesn't help. Can't come up. Is my gas mask doing all right? Yeah, it's fine. Ha ha! Alright. Yeah! It's not easy. But we're getting there one step at a time. Oh no. 
I think if I redirect the water lane to power the grid. What the fuck did I just do? What did I just do? <sighs> That's all I can do right there. Interesting. Keep your fingers out of the product. Nothing touchable here. That is what I just touched, right? And it still looks like it should be a touchable object. <laughs> Enzo. Why is it like that? Well, I guess. I don't really get why it's so shiny. Enzo! I will crate you, boy. Oh, here's one. Come on, boy. Oh, no. I think if I redirect the motor lane to power the grid. Ha <laughs> ha. the grenades. Right, I can open that bloody door now, I hope. Okay. No betting, no jousting. Absolutely no betting on jousting. Yeah, I'm exhausted now, but I think I'm going to fight something. Go figure. Not if you run fast enough, you rotten fools. Let's have a conversation. I'm sorry, no, I'm not Let's have a constructive conversation. Well, I have an electrical shot. If it fails to improve it, I just want to go. Hey! No. That I did not expect. Where are you going? Oh, he's Thank inside. Thank God you came when you did. Oh, no, there we go. I didn't realise he was patriotic like that. Look, I'm, I'm doing a newspaper story. Uh, about how well you're all holding up down here. I think I've read that article a few times. How well are you holding up down here? On good days, we get more things working than break down. And on bad days? Like today, look, there's a big electronic board down there. Tells us what's broken. Ironically, that works perfect. Huh? Here's a diagram. Oof. Oh, look, it's time for my tea break. Ta-ra! Ta-ra! This isn't a diagram. It's a letter. A permanent solution. Again? What kind of permanent solution is he thinking of? Whatever it is, I bet that's what got Gemma taken away by the doctors. Dear Penelope, I received your note about the la latest batch of joy. You did the right thing in writing to me directly. I'm Tranu. I am working on a permanent solution that will render our current joy program obsolete. But you didn't hear it from me. Warmly, Anton. Please convey my warm regards to Richard. I've been meaning to have you both around to dinner. It's been too long. Okay. Jubilator quick start manual. Step one, get in the cockpit. Step two, press the go button. Step three, go. Thanks, thanks. 
To Penelope from Peter. I don't like to be the teller of tales, but Thomas Horner is the one making book on the Jubilator races. He is always tempting us to bet than taking our money. Other people's money, I mean. I never bet myself. I also believe he's monkeying with the Jubilator speed dials to fix the races. Many workers, not me of course, get in debt to him and are forced to hand over their paychecks. I thought you would want to know, since you put such trust in him. Nearly idiot proof. I'd still find a way to fuck it up. <laughs> Enzo, why are you being noisy? Alright, to Thomas from Penelope, I am sorry to inform you that promotion to second shift manager has been denied on account of your behavioral infractions. I am shocked to learn that gambling is going on here. When Peter... Oh, way to fucking call him out. When Peter explained the situation to me, I had no choice but to make him supervisor instead. P.S. In light of your precarious position here, I would not be making book on any Guy Fox Day jousting tournaments if I were you. P.P.S. If you per persist in proclaiming your innocence, then I suppose I don't owe you ten quid for the Grand Derby, do I? A permanent solution. Again. Wow. A better chemistry kit. What? Ugh. Best workbench? What does it do? Yeah, I drop some stuff, Arthur. Or it's no, gonna be tediously it? slow going. Pilot is trapped inside. Do not eat my yogurt. Do, do, do. Enzo, stop barking inside. You never used to. Just because she's here doesn't mean you can Shot start. Grenade. I wonder if that's what I'll need to kill this berserk tea kettle. Berserk tea kettle? Oh, if I would have come all the way through, but I already had an electrical tool. <laughs> I think it's safe to take off this gas mask so I don't have to sit here and listen to it. Boy, don't make it come out there. Report back to Mrs. Oliphant. How far away is she? All over here, there's a hatch there, okay. Cause I need to A, drop off some stuff from my inventory and B, I need to sleep a little. That's not a good time. But old under hasn't changed since old George V. Okay. Tinkle room. This is what I needed. Uh, there, that helped out quite a bit. There's a bed. It's interesting. I, I can. If I only sleep for an hour, it brings my thing up to 100%. My, uh, fatigue, look, and I only slept for an hour. But how did we do it? Didn't they have tanks? Miss Tamling okay, Goggin, thank um, you very much for writing. Yes, it's easy to be confused by the events of those long gone days. I always forget where the ladder is in the sun. So yeah, so I can run on no sleep forever, and then sleep for an hour would be good. Oh, do I have, do I, oh no, I need eight. Oh. So in the upper left hand corner, it shows me if I'm um, fatigued or not. I wonder if that's, huh. But yeah, it's got my joy meter and everything in the upper left hand corner. I wonder, uh, no, it's too much work. I was gonna, <laughs> I was gonna move stuff around. That's a lot. That's a lot, a lot. Is this ready to go? Oh, yeah. This is... Do I really have to sneak all the way back in there? Am I in the right place? 
Yeah, this is the report place. Who's down there? It's Freya. Terribly busy. What is it? Jeb has been taken away. I saw two doctors shove her into a pop. Oh my goodness. Why? She was digging into the tunnels. That didn't come out right. I, I, I followed up. The whole underground is sort of falling apart. Of March. Oh my. That's why you sent her, wasn't it? Not to write about the tunnel rats. I certainly couldn't print a story like that, could I? The joy's yeah. gone bad, and Dr. Verloc knows. I, uh, but he's telling them not to down. worry. He's got some sort of permanent solution. We'll we'll, we'll be that here. doesn't sound ominous at all. Well, that's sort of exactly what I thought. If I had a press pass, I could get into Hayworth Labs. Um, Right. And my old adulator, if you still got it. After what happened to Gemma, Dr. Verloc, he's sort of his own law there. I have some personal business there. If I'm not here when you get back, if you found something out, see if you can't publish it. Those numpties out there know how to put the ink on the page, but the only articles they ever read are their own. You're getting out. How? Oh, I wouldn't even know how to get out. But you never know when I might stop printing lines. And they won't like that. Huh. Great. I've got all my press stuff back. That ought to be handy. You can show up all sorts of places regular people shouldn't go. Um... <laughs> yes, I have explained and beyond that, the way this is all set up is... On one side. I guess I could... I could make other scenes. Ah! Um... So it's in different corners. Mm. Alright, so spankers, peepers, and jubilators no, or take longer to detect you. Not no longer. Fuck me. Take longer, which is nice, because they keep yelling at me. Hello? I'd like to go in there. Can I just walk out the front now? Y'all still in here drinking your coffee? Alright, whatever you say. Where is this lab? Oh, do, 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 do. Where is the lab? Oh, all the way here. We're fine. We can go there. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Guess if that's what they want to do, that's what they want to do. Ugh, being able to run is so much nicer. Yeah, you take your joy. Oh, I forgot. I have to watch out for the doctors. Because the doctors can tell that I haven't taken my joy. This place is creepier than hell. Hi, there. What's cooking good looking? He does love to be in the papers and right yeah, on Yeah, it was a doctor. I told him the labs was on lockdown. They don't listen anymore. Well, you certainly laid out a convincing argument. Are you saying I hit him too hard? I don't know. Is he breathing? Well, he made a sort of sigh. And then some gurgling noises? He came right at me. Just make sure you leave that electro baton near him. In case he turns out to be important. I've learned so much from you over the years. Well, that's fun. Oh, I was gonna show you what's up. I was gonna show you my puppy, dear, but she's sleeping at my feet again. But I got a puppy. 
Final. Where do you think She's you're here? going then? We're not open to the general public. Bugger all. I'm interviewing Dr. Verloc. Ah, you're a member of the Fourth Estate. You've come at an awkward time, you see, as we're just in the middle of... Um... Well, there's been a bit of excitement in the lab. Best come back tomorrow. You're not saying something's gone wrong? No, of course not. Everything's peachy. Look, all right, you take your press pass up to Helen in public relations. Just uh, follow the sort of brown-coloured line. I must ask you not to stray from the path, because there's all sorts of delicate machinery and chemicals and whatnot, and we don't want you hurting yourselves, do we? What sort of crisis makes them lock down the entire factory? They moved the chair right up behind me. I came back on my own chair. Come here, princess. Oh, my. You're so fat. You're so fat. This is a her. Her name is Freya. Luna Freya. Lady Luna Freya. <laughs> She's so sleepy. She's so fat, though. Her paws are bigger than Enzo's already. Look, my family. They're all here. My little princess. Yeah, you're my little princess. Oh, okay, I gotta put you back down, okay? Thank you for waking up. Alright. Oh my gosh, she's just sitting in my lap. Help. Okay, princess, I'm gonna put you down. Back down. Roar. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> she laid right back down. She is so tired right now. It is definitely nap time. That is okay. And then this ding dong won't stop playing with her. She plays with her all the time. She's probably the reason she's so tired. Shut up, dear. Woke we'll up for you. Lay down, Enzo. She's sleeping. Hey, you heard me. Lay down. To all employees, <laughs> we've had a wee accident. The constables are here to help us. Please cooperate by carrying your ID at all times as they don't know who's who. Is here will have the same respect for a press pulse as the Bobbies did. Guys, I don't have any joy. I don't think. Oh, but I have sunshine. You are not authorized. Please clear the area. Ah! Is this is okay. Buy stuff. <gasps> they have first aid kits. There's like three more albino. Great. No, don't don't pop that quest up you ding dong. Now it's all up in my way. Yeah, you missed out. I had fun. Um I think that's where I'm going. Oh no, I'm in here with labs. Um, it was actually a lot of fun, and I got to see War Cow, and it was a good time. We got to play a bunch of arcade games, get drunk, <laughs> play more arcade games, get more drunk, decontaminate. Anyway. Told the police, but we all enjoy a good laugh. Pranks in the employee lounge have gotten out of hand. Today, Roger became quite alarmed that his tea time macaron, macaroon had made him shrink after several employees remarked that he seemed to be getting smaller. In fact, some person or persons unknown went to the trouble of replacing his uniform with an identical but larger one. Valuable work time was wasted by the sound foolery. In future, kindly confine your pranks to your off hours. Alice. <laughs> that's, that's mean. All right, decontaminating. Mind the closing doors, please. Please stand by for decontamination. Product purity is our highest goal no at Hayworth Labs. 
The decontamination procedure allows us to maintain the highest standard of purity. Oh, so glad they're concerned about purity. You have been decontaminated. Please sure? proceed into the lab. Do so? not turn down the heat on the brominating reaction until you've noted the temperature curve. I need to determine the explosive threshold temperature. Oh. Never mind. Please just lock it. Just grab the temperature curve and pop it in the pneumatic. Oh, and I want samples Ooh. of any residue on the explosive debris. I want all of that. Four of these. Damn, these things hurt. Well, that didn't go the way I wanted it to. I'm taking all of these. Alright, so we need to way past this door. What's up here? Something out. No. Point tools away from you. Thanks. Oh fuck! I am no good at the sneaking deal. Do we really have to do this? Safety. Yep. Yeah, just punch him. Don't use your tool. Sorry. Yeah, that's. <laughs> you know what, Tweet? Just because you're right doesn't mean you needed to say I don't it. Think I want to try and cross that steam. I hope I can turn it off somewhere. Um, absolutely dare. I'm busy this weekend. It's my last weekend of vacation, so, you know, I'm busy. But I will be on Monday night, for sure. Probably Tuesday, too, so, well, Monday afternoon. Like 5 o'clock, 5.30. If you want to do something then. God damn it, every time I'm going to take them down. No, put that away. And we see the violence inherent in the system. I wonder which one of these controls the steam. Or do they both? 
Sounds good. I feel so chivalrous turning off that dangerous steam. If that is indeed what I did. All right. Deceased. I didn't kill no one. Oof. All right. There have better be ah! disabled samples. I went way farther than I should have. Of the fog. The next time I come down there, just get a one gallon beaker, stick it in the fog, stopper it, take the stopper, and label it. Rob, this is fun. Gosh darn it. There we go. I am fucking up over here. Maybe I can sneak past these gents without a fuss. Nothing to see here. We can't run with all this stuff. I love how many Better of these something away before something starts chasing you. Look at all of them. Mm mm mm. Oh, are they? None of them are of any use. Oh, I just hadn't used them. No. Don't. Fucking empty. I was so excited! This is the latest test formula. I, I know. think I'll just take this with me. Evidence or something. Permanent solution. Drive the subject insane. Oh lord. A big red button. I wonder what it opens. Well, let me finish searching the office. I feel rather brilliant right now. all the time and I wouldn't have any worries. I didn't notice. Uh, clothes. There we are. Welcome back, Zelda. Of weapons that don't work. Hey, hundred hours, I'll do you that. Oh, that's so maddening. Look at them all. Oh, 
Look, it's not you, it's me. I don't know, but I have two in my inventory. So if I can't repair them, then we're good either way. Funny. So I remember that time I threatened to thrash Timmy Hargreaves because he said rotten things about Sally. And it turned out he had an older brother who'd been in the army. Dr. Verloc is thinking very hard, sir. No visitors. The brominating reaction has caught fire. Sir, sorry to bother you, sir. But there's a fellow here says the reaction tank is on fire again. I said no interruptions. Some of the byproducts are poisonous. He says it's poisonous, sir. Of course there are poisonous byproducts. Tell him to do whatever they did the last time. Dr. Verloc would like you to do whatever you did the last time. No one knows that. He's an imposter. Implement security protocol 187. Oh, yes, sir. That's my favorite protocol. I am full of the fury of the Lord, and I am quite right weary fuck? with holding back. Right, I'm done fooling around. Maybe we can go right at him. The Lord judges me, and he is angry every day. You shall drink the wine of God's wrath. Why are you so weird? It's not personal. It's nothing personal. Nibby. Yeah, nothing personal. I just want to knock you out, bud. You too. Come here. Oh, please don't make a fuss. You know I'm dead. Tell me, tits. Well, I guess we're gonna fight. What have we come to? It was literally one hit. I think that's it. Oh, well. Hi, bud. Hi, bud. Look, I don't even want to be here. You're whiny. Do they have joy pills? Oh, there's someone over here. Bye! <laughs> I'm not dead, quit worrying. What am I doing? Getting all this joy, yo. Just in case. Is that supposed to be ironic? Is that an original? Sergeant! Sergeant! Do 
Did you know half your uh, workers are unconscious? The, the, the fumes issue will resolve itself. Look, I'm very busy recalculating the brominating reaction so it is non-explosive. Unless you've got a magic formula for synthesizing joy out of bleach, whiskey, and saltpeter, get out! You're planning to lobotomize the people of Wellington Wells, aren't you? Lobotomize is a rather inflammatory She's metaphor. A... But yes, I have been asked to synthesize something stronger and more permanent than joy. Who are you? If you force people to have the emotions you want, then you've turned them into robots made out of meat! <laughs> and what do you think you are now? You are just the sum of the neuropeptides swirling in your bloodstream. You see, the current downer outbreak is just a mass chemical imbalance. But I believe I can adjust the internal hormonal settings so the people stay happy no matter what. You can't do that. They told the Wright brothers they couldn't fly, but they did. You can't do that. Oh, my lord. You're that downer they've been warning us about. I'm actually just here for a bottle of cod liver oil. What makes you think I'll give it to you? This bottle of your new formula. If I smash it and you breathe the fumes, will it make you happy forever and always? You mustn't. It makes the patient insane. Ha! Now you can't move until I take my hand off this button. What are you gonna do? Oh, shit. <laughs> Where's the bloody cod liver oil Sally wanted? This is the cleanest office I've ever seen. Mm. Where does he hide his junk? This letter has been everywhere. This is the third time we've read this letter. Test. All right. We have had mixed results for our first test of A329. The subject, Vanessa Tinkerbell, <laughs> came to us presenting downer symptoms of melancholy and unpleasant memories. We are pleased to report that is no longer the case. There have been side effects, however. Tinkerbell was formerly one of Village's foremost intellectuals. She now has difficulty with basic cognitive functions and exhibits obsessive behaviors, e.g. she runs around herself lapping her hands and seems to believe she can fly. Recommendation, further research on A329 required. At a minimum, it should only be used on the most severe downer cases. Yeah, remember we were getting cod liver oil for Gemma. I a secret lair. Oh, it's just the Hello. I'm in a haunted house movie. Sally's ridiculous cod liver oil. I better be down oh, here. Oh, not Gemma, Sally. Cross. Find another memory. Listen. Sally Boyle's going to come live with us for a bit. Sally Boyle? Why? Because her mum poisoned the whole bloody rest of her family, Arthur. And because we've got a spare bed in the attic now till Percy comes back from Germany. You're right. She's your age, you know. She's an idiot. Well then, you two should get along beautifully. Oof. Thanks, Dad. Dr. Verloc seems to be quite the collector. Where's the fucking cod liver oil? Oh. The new caretaker threw me on the floor. Barmy thinks he's the rightful king of England. Bites? Free permission to restrain or tranquilize at caregiver's discretion. What does the button do? The king of X! Ah! The king of X! The king of X! Don't laugh, Arthur. Don't laugh. <laughs> Is this like cousin bumping gets? No girls. Can't talk to them. Very aggro, especially in presence of Dr. Verloc. Special privileges include one extra biscuit at tea time. Do not include promenades. He has fooled the staff before. Have your wits about you. Attempted suicide via banging head against the wall.
Oh, somebody escaped. Oh, Gemma. What? Staff your mother's welfare, attempted to bribe caretaker with sexual favors, meals denied as punishment, violent slapping, vomiting, refusal to speak. Reporter, delusional, claims Wellington Wells about to collapse, recommend lobotomy. Deliberate attempts to sabotage scientific data, extremely manipulative, multiple attempts to escape. Well, obviously she did, I don't think I need this stuff, it was Gemma. And thank you, Sally, for another wonderful adventure. Okay, chemistry questions. Dear Dr. Ver Verlo, uh, Thank you so much for showing me your laboratory when I visited with Mr. Adams. As you can imagine, it was very exciting for a girl from a small chemist shop. I myself have been trained to become a chemist and have learned pretty much everything Mr. Adams has to teach me. I wonder if I might come by your laboratory sometime to ask you about more advanced chemistry questions. It would be such a privilege to learn from a real advanced scientist. Sincerely, Sally Boyle. To general being from Vern Low. I hope you will not think a mere research chemist is out of line in contacting you, but I am frankly concerned about Dr. Hayworth. Despite Joy's great success, he has begun allocating resources toward his study of phrenology, a laughably discredited 19th century pseudo science. Indeed, he talks of little else when he thinks no one can hear him. I am not suggesting he is actually sabotaging the factory. The recent shortages are, re oh my God, are the results of mix-ups that anyone could have made. But I know you share my concern about the importance of our work to Wellington Wells, and he won't listen to me or anybody else. What do you recommend we do? You like him? I was on the fence about him, so if you guys like him, that makes me feel a little better. I mean, they're, they're a thing. They exist, and, like, I'm glad. But, I, uh, yeah. Alright, to the new secretary. I hope you have better success in this job than I did. You should know that Dr. V is most insistent that all traces of a certain woman be expunged from the laboratory. Excuse me. Well, good tweak. I'm glad. Uh, if you ask me, she who must not be named was the brains behind the whole operations. It hasn't been the same since she left. Dr. V will ask you for information that is in her notes, but you can't give him one of her notes. Oh no, or else you'll be stacked like me. I've hidden her papers in the storage room, the computer room, which used to be her office, so you can get them without his knowing. It's complicated, but I'm sure you'll manage. Good luck, Betty. P.S. Dr. V also gets his knickers in a knot if you nip, nip some of his good scotch. Just a word to the wise. This doesn't look like where the pills go out. What's going on this conveyor belt? <laughs> Possibly me. We're just walking right by. Oh, no. Door. Jammed. Door? I got glitched in there. Oh, that smells awful. This is where they flush the chemicals. Well, I mean, right now they're flushing the chemicals everywhere. Dr. 
drain? To where? The river? Might be a way out, if I don't mind poisoning the river. Not that anything's alive in here. Oh, here it is. No bueno. Did they fall in? Or were they pushed? Or were they flushed? Yeah, and I just drained <sighs> it into the river. A hatch. Lovely. I've never seen so many hatches in my entire life. Oh, that tripped me out. We'll take this hatch. Well, that was scenic. I want to know what he's seeing. Going. After nearly getting me killed, she better have my bloody letter of transit. So, Sally, Salamander. She's not here, I swear to God I'll kill her. Hi. I got it. Your precious cod liver oil. Oh, you're a lifesaver. It's a bloody souvenir. God, it's awful. Have you got my letter of transit then? Arthur, we're practically the only two people in this entire city not stoned out of our minds on she joy. Doesn't have it. How are you holding up? What do you care? How are you going to get out? Why won't you just give me the fucking letter of transit? Oh, it's always what you want. Always what you need. Every little Sally whim. Bloody cod liver oil. Do you really th think I'm that awful? What, just because you fucked my dad while you were living in our house, in my mum's bed? <sighs> I'm sorry. <sighs> Look, I don't hate you. In the strangest way, you're completely innocent. You're practically the only one I know who is. Yes, yeah. it's on the dresser there. Are you going to be OK? I could take you with me. Really? We have to go now. The joy's gone bad. It's going crazy out there. I can't go right now. Why? Oh, God. No. It's not simple. It never is. We'll have to wait till dawn. No, that, that, that's crazy. I, I can't. Oh, you shouldn't have asked for that ridiculous cod liver oil. Look, there's something I haven't been entirely straight with you about. Mm. It's just self-preservation, Sally. No hard feelings. Do you think she really meant it? The kiss and all? What if I went back and said, yes, yes, I'll take you, and... They lived happily ever after. Oh, the girl like that shipwrecks, and the next day she's drinking margaritas under palm trees and you'll suffer for shocks. That is it. Never again. You are not authorized. Please clear the area immediately. Hope she doesn't like me. Where? I'll bring all of them back up here. Really I'm gonna make it to the bridge and then I've gotta I gotta go after that.
Bye guys, bye guys. Oh, I still have my gas mask on. So many constables. Lovely day for it. May I see your letter of transit, please? Grabby, Jesus. Welcome to the parade, sir. And may I say you've arrived not a moment too soon. What do you mean, Constable? A word to the efficient is sufficient, sir. If you catch my drift. I would not count on this bridge remaining operational in the near future. Nudge, nudge, smirk, smirk. Say no more, say no more. Okay. We like to work, are we? I don't like trains, Arthur. Are you joking? You love trains. Do you remember when we went to Plymouth on that train? You didn't want to get off. That was in 1941. Yeah, it must have been. I... I... I, I don't want you to go to Germany. You think I want to go? I don't know where we're going, I don't know what they're going to do with us there, and who knows if we're ever really coming back. But I don't have much of a bloody choice, do I? You would talk to me when you're gone. Dad talks to you? Well, no, I suppose he doesn't really. But he does love you. I believe you, Arthur. He's just really rubbish at showing it. Hmm. Ah, the parade. Just like I pictured it. Strange to be back here. How long ago was it I used to just trundle off to work every day, right around here? Now I just need to get into the broadcast tower so I can this get into Appleholm Station and find the train tracks to the Britannia Bridge. to hit it. I just wanted to see if they would stop me. I'm going to have to rewrite the entire bloody report. Can you believe that? Lovely day for it. Guarding stuff, but I don't think they are. I think they're just posted there. The Fashion Institute. I bought some trousers there. Bloody expensive, too. If I remember correctly, they've got a hatch in their basement. Good thing Sally taught me to be nosy. Who knows when I might need to get to a bed? I should see if I can get down there. Okay, well, we definitely want to do this hatch thing, but I do have to go. For today, I'll be back uh, Monday. Oh, so much to get done, but I'm glad they eventually took a nap so that way we could we could do this a little bit. But I will be back Monday. We will can oh we will not continue this since I'm going to be doing Overwatch with Dare. But we'll get back to this. There's a lot more gameplay to this than I expected. I didn't expect to be spending so much time on it, but I'm enjoying it. Thank you guys for joining. I will see you soon. Bye.
Was it always seen Like I'm moving backwards Caught up in a dream Everybody's actor Was it always seen Like people change faces And nothing is real Don't need all the answers, just tell me what life is for One day I'ma wake up with a reaper at the door 